Hello everyone and welcome to another video here on the Second Day Gaming Channel and today we're doing another one What if Jonas Vingor was in a race that he clearly wouldn't win and today it is Ronde van Vlanderen and this is going to be a very exciting Obviously, one this Melissa bike have one of the strongest teams but I'm going to elect that we don't pick them or maybe pretend that Wout van Aert isn't in the team I think that's probably the best way of doing this uh, Laporte, he's also very strong, so... Ah, it feels wrong. Okay, maybe... Maybe it's fine. We'll, we'll include him. Uh, but the sacrificial lamb will be Olaf Koy, and then we'll just slot in Jonas Vingor into this troop, and that should be amazing. Alright, so here we are, start of the Ronde van Vlanderen, and uh, yeah, Jonas Vingor bidding to be the first danger winner since Kespa Eskain, so uh, not that long wait. But uh, yeah, who's going to be on babysitting duties for Jonas Vingor here? Oh, sorry Tratnik, it's your role. But uh, yeah, we might as well fast forward a bit to get into the more tastier part of the race. We can see Ethan Hater attacking off the front. Mark Hirschi as well. I mean, we don't wait. Actually, we need to make sure that our oh, crash, crash. We're not effective, uh, but we need to make sure that none of our riders are gonna go do silly things like trying to win the race when we're actually only interested in Jonas Winkel right now. Sorry, Wout. Well. Um, but yeah, Metro Vanderpool obviously in the race as well. Nicholas Arndt attacking. We don't really care about that. 244 kilometers still to go. So um, yeah, we'll fast forward until we get to around yeah that climb there, and then we'll do free play. But so and Van Schild attacking. I mean, we don't really care about any of these attacks right now. To be honest, we only really care about Vingor survival. That's it. And uh, I mean, a top 20 that would be insane. Obviously, we know his rival, Tade Bogaccia, has won this race, which, yeah, kind of puts the bar quite high. And, um, yeah, for a Tour de France winner, but I don't think we're going to have that issue, maybe. Uh, issue? Um, delight. But, yeah, we can see the breakaway out in front, more than six minutes. Who's in this break? Jordi Moss. Remember, he finished uh, third in Gevwelgem recently. I don't think you're going to see him out there. Tim Murley as well. Edith Schelling. Uh, Alex Aramburo, uh, Welton, De Gent, I'm not sure it's that De Gent, I think it's the Cofidis De Gent, it is. And yeah, Simon Clark as well. So, interesting times ahead in this race. 185 kilometers still to go now. Just making sure that we keep the speed. We can see that Jonas is in top shape out of all problems. Sam Wellsford crashes, oops, and Gellerts. Uh, not sure who that is, but. Uh, Unfortunately, he crashed. But uh, Vingo, rubbing shoulders with Mancho Van der Poel here. Is Mancho Van der Poel going to have as much fear as he had with uh, Tadavagata? Probably not. Why am I downplaying Jonas Vingo? We're winning this. Come on. Come on, guys. We're going to win this. 164 kilometers to go. We're coming into our first real cobble... Cl cobble classic? No, cobble sector here. Lieben Hosenstraat. Two, se two stars. We're not really in the best position here. Uh, we could move up. Afini's around him, so we've got support. Let's be real, we're not going to lose minutes here. Uh, I'm just hoping that we're going to avoid a crash. I mean, Vingor, why not up there with Laporte and... and uh, what, Van Aert? Where, where's where's Vingor? Do we just lose... Oh, Vingor's there. So, uh, let's try... Oh, here we go. First cobble sector. Come on, Jonas. Oh, crash, crash. Crash in front of us, he avoided it. Best fuel down and backs down. Noobs, can't even have double cobbles. But Jonas Vingo is through the first sector, it is the second sector. Come on, Jonas, you've got Tratnik next to you. A man who's won Omnute Hit Newsblood guiding you through this. Yes, we've accomplished it. Two for two. Two for two. We're still in this main group. Still in this main group. Um, yeah, okay. Who's taking control of this? It looks like Sudal Quicks there. No, Groupama FDJ. It's kind of a collaboration, conglomeration between uh, Groupama, Jayco? No, Alpacin. Grove's change, obviously. Uh, Little Trek, Alpacin, and the King, Match Van Pol of Flanders. Can we mark him? No, we can't. But you can see Wat Minard and Macho. Wat well, doesn't care about you, honest. Let's be honest. Not in this this scenario. He's thinking about the win. But uh, we don't really care about Wilds for win in this race. Imagine if he wins. 
And who else? Navais, the Ecuadorian national champion. Christoph, I think we need to speed up to get to our next sector. And the breakaway still have a lead of more than four minutes. Is that going to come down? No, it's actually gone up. Five minutes. And we can see Bini, the, ooh, big crash. Honor Demar, he was someone everyone was touting as a potential winner of this race. Former Milan San Remo winner. But Affini is getting up there working for some reason. I mean, Affini, I don't really want you working at the front. So uh, just just take it easy. Just don't do not do anything. Don't stress. Uh, you got Macho Van Der Poel there. Kuhn. Ghana. Walt Van Aert. Where's Bingo? Bingo, where are you? There he is. It's going to be a close one, this. 134 kilometers still to go. Let's speed it up a bit more. And we're coming to our order quadramart. Oh, okay, okay. Bingo, this is dangerous. Okay, get up there. You like a climb. Get up to Lawrence Pithy. This is going to be interesting. Is he going to be able to hold it on this? One of the big test four-star couple sector. Come on, Jonas. You've got this. You've got this. You've got this. If Afini just struggling a bit as well. Macho Van Der Poel, is he trying to do something here? Not really. Bingo, where are you? Oh, Steimler, puncture. Bingo, sitting there, rubbing shoulders with the likes of Hater, Pitlison. Get on Pitlison's wheel. Oh, he can't do that yet. Okay, we survived Order Quaramont. We survived the Order Quaramont. Okay. Still 128 kilometers to go. But a uh, good ride so far, good ride. It looks like hes it's not taking too much out of him. I mean, it's climb. It's just a few cobblestones. Can't be that dangerous. Um, and uh, let's see what our next couple sector is. Hulebeck, uh coming up in 4.6 kilometers. Uh, we're seeing some tactics going on here at the front. And who we got? We've got... Groupama FDJ, do they really believe that Stephen Kuhn has the chance of winning here? This is going to haunt me. He's probably going to win now. Just carrying the race a bit forward. Uh, Hulaveg didn't seem to be too hard. Kirkgate is the next one coming up. And yeah, Ricard taking us through that. And it seems we're fairly fine. So next one is Jagger. Oh, crash. What we're not, what we're not crashing. Do we care about that? Do we care about what we're not? Oh, he's back in the group. Well, sorry about. We did care. Uh, yeah, obviously he's a huge card for Vingo to play later on. Probably takes the win, if if I'm honest. But uh, yeah, Molenberg coming up next. I mean, yeah, Jakobsen puncture there, but uh, yeah, we still have Grupama pushing it on with. Alpes in here. We still have Vingo in prime position here. Next, rubbing shoulders with Macho Van Der Poel and Ghana. I mean, Ghana, is he a great Tour of Flanders winner? It doesn't really ring any bells. Vingo um, still sitting up there. Can't get rid of him. Macho, you need to be scared of another Tour de France winner here. But yeah, let's just speed it along. We're inside the last 90 kilometers now. Inside the last 90 kilometers. So. The couple sectors are coming thick and fast now, shortly. And this is where we're going to see whether uh, Vingol can really hold it, hold his own on these cobbles. And uh, yeah, this is going to be very... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Um, survived another one. Van der Storm. What a name. San Carl Anderson. It's littered with Danes here in the front of the race. There's Pilters in there. Jonas Vingol, San Carl and yeah you want to swing goal uh tivo Ness falling as well what a card he is to play as well in this classics campaign but 68 kilometers still to go here ghana up there peacock is here mate morahic hater yeah a lot of strong riders 77 riders left now uh so some riders gone out the back door here including christoph former winner taco van der Horn. And uh, yeah, uh, Ben Healy, why was he even in this race? Litsenko, unfortunately. Yeah, it's just ticking down the riders. Go Ooh, Jonathan Milan going out completely. Order Quaramont coming up shortly as well, so look out for that. This is going to be very fascinating to see if we can survive another round of it. Uh, so far, so good in the first round, but you can see it's up to Koenig really pushing it on here. 
well, are they pushing it on? I don't think they are pushing completely out. They're just doing a bit of relaying. And the breakout in front, are they starting to splinter here? They lost one rider. Uh, Nichols aren't there. Uh, Who's that one rider there in the middle? Oh, it's Timulia. Timulia's cracked. That's a shame. But 77 becomes 75. And uh, Vermeer's here. Now they're starting to push on here on, on the descent. Should we just increase the tempo a bit here with Afini? Should we just annoy everyone, just throw a bit of pace into this? Afini just drilling it downhill here. Oh yeah, you can see the group there teetering on splitting just because of that small acceleration. And we're less than a kilometer into the order quadrant, so I'm going to just take it a bit easy here because we're going to focus our efforts on Jonas Vingol. Uh, Macho Van Der Poel is there. It's 54 kilometers. I don't think we're going to have anyone do a move. And as I say that, it looks like Tibones might go up the front. Hmm. I mean, should we attack with Jonas? I don't feel like that. Oh, oh, Macho, Macho. What's Macho doing? Can we watch Macho? No, we still can't do that. Bax having a dreadful day. Vinga go on the wheel of... Yes, go, go on. Go on Wat Van Aert's wheel. Come on. Jonas, where are you? Jonas, oh, crash, crash. Was that, was that Macho? That was Macho. Macho just fell. Oh my goodness. I mean, it's still 51 kilometers to go, so it's a bit far out. Um, what's happening now? We've got a split here. Split. Are we gonna make uh, Van Baal work? Yeah, Van Baal, you work. We've got a split here. Is this fair? No, but life isn't fair. Sorry, Macho. Is Macho, oh, okay, he's almost back, but. Vingegaard in a great position right now. Come on, Vingegaard. On the wheel of Wat Van Aert. This is phenomenal riding by the Dane. Come on, Jonas. Uh, we still have Macho back in... Well, he's sort of back, but I mean, he's going to be a bit hampered by that uh, crash that he had earlier. We've lost Tratnik, unfortunately. We still have... Uh, I think Tratnik is a bit further back, so unfortunately he's not in this group. Laporte. I desperately want Laporte back in this group. I think the group's going to somewhat come back together here. Uh, Van Baal doing relays, but we don't really have to do that, I think. Uh, Wat Van Aert, wait, wow, wait, wow is... What, 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 wow, chill, chill, wow, you don't need to... What are you doing? We have the... Wow, what are you doing? Calm, calm it. That was bad riding, well. Chill. Okay, uh, we're coming up to the next climb here. And, okay, well, you can pace it a bit here. Uh, Jorna is still sitting in a good position here. Sturvin, Metromanopol, Fred Wright, the British national champion. And Jordi Merce, one of the breakaway riders, just going out the back here. Miguel Honoré, ooh, is that Valentin Madouaz? Valentin Madouaz struggling a bit there. Uh, Loscano out the back. And if you saw the top five in, on the second day in extra, you'll know that I put him as one of the favourites. And... Well, we're not using him up. That was a stupid decision by me. Sorry, well, that was my bad. My bad completely. Uh, Laporte, you need to defend Jonas Vingol with everything you've got. Uh, we're coming on to another one. This is a two-sector. Uh, Laporte struggling there at the back. Laporte, why are you not doing what I said? Defend Jonas with your life. Uh, we're seeing that the work at the front is not evenly distributed. Are we seeing some riders go up the front here that we weren't following? Yeah, Van Der Poel's gone. Van Der Poel's gone. I missed that completely. Van Der Poel's gone. All hands on deck. This is not an emergency. Well, this is not a rehearsal. Uh, what are we saying? Never mind. Van Der Poel is off the front. That is all we have to worry about now. Uh, Van Baal, where are you? Van Baal, you need to guide Jonas Vengel back to the wheel of of um actually let's do a train here so van baal you guide what we and jonas being got back to the train and tis benut i don't know what you're doing you're just helping here so just chill mess pilsen's in that group but we are going to come up shortly because we got van baal what and jonas being on an exciting little journey here 33 kilometers to go still but uh yeah it's all still to play for Teespinut, what are you doing? Teespinut, chill, chill. Take a bottle. But yeah, Nils Pollard, Tom Pitcock, Mass Pilsen, and out in front you've got Stoven and Matthew Vanderpool chasing down Stefan Kung. 
I mean, Stephen Kuhn told me, I was the one making fun of Stephen Kuhn why they were doing so much work. But we are in the fourth group, I would guess. And uh, yeah, Van Baal, sorry everyone, I missed that move by, by, uh, yeah, by uh, uh, Van Der Poel. But we're coming back, we're bringing them back slowly. So a top five, top ten is still on the cards here. Remember, I don't really care about, uh, about... Wout Van Aert, sorry Wout Van Aert. Oh, we still have Laporte here. Laporte would be a good person to use now as well. Laporte, get this back for us. Get, oh actually, I think uh, Laporte needs to be the one guiding, guiding uh, Jonas here because uh, the two other riders are spent. Dillman Baal spent. Wout Van Aert spent. Just get in the group guys, maybe they can recover a bit. But Laporte is driving on this pace now. We've got two riders ahead of us. That means that, yeah, is that La we're getting back Macho Van Der Poel. That is phenomenal riding by by uh, Laporte. Let's just let him cook a bit longer. Just chill. Just take it easy. Let him burn for a few more kilometers out there in the front. Laporte just doing a formidable turn of work here. And, uh, yeah, the beers on him, well, should be on Bingo here after the race. Oh, attacked there by Tom Pickock. We don't really care. Well, we do care. Pogacar's here. Pogacar. Oh, no. Pogacar. Bingo. Your rival's here. Oh, he's doing us dirty here, Pogacar. That is not nice. If Pogacar wins this, that will be very bad because Pogacar's not even in the 2024 race. But uh, Laporte slowly bringing this back. Surely but surely. We've got 18 kilometers to go here. If we can just take it... Easy. Bingo goal. You have a better sprint than Pogacar. <laughs> no, he doesn't. We all know that. Um, it's not the high mountains of the Col de la Loz, but we're doing our best here to try and drag him back. Jonas, time to take that gel. Let's just bridge this Slovenian back here. Let's. He can't have that much energy, can he? I mean, he did a, what, 81 kilometer attack in Strabianki, but... Yeah, I think we had the Paterberg still left. That's it. All that separates us. Oh, come on, Jonas. Stick with it. Stick with it. This is a golden opportunity to get one over on your arch rival of your uh, Tadabagacha. Come on. This is it. This is it. This we, we actually need one more gel, if I'm honest. One more gel, and we would be sitting pretty. But for whatever reason, we don't have that. Uh, Ghana, Morhech... Uh, Mohoric um, Laporte we still got 11 kilometers to go here come on Laporte you've got this in you come on someone else help us nobody else is helping poor Laporte uh, but Jonas is here if I pull a top 5 or a podium off with Jonas Vingo that I, I definitely need a medal or something but uh, yeah compared to some of the other slip-ups that we've had on this channel already with Jonas Vingo. I think this is one of the tactical best ones we've had so far. Maybe Wout Van Aert, that was a bit of a mistake. We should have had him, um, well, used him later. Oh, shoot. Ghana spent. Come on, guys. Do something. Mate, pull. Ghana, pull. You Both of you have had an armchair ride, courtesy of our very nice friend, Laporte, but uh, we'll try and get Laporte to do something here. Is this where Jonas is going to just attack this group? So Jonas just... Oh, no. Mate has something in him. Oh, Mate, you sneaky, sneaky Slovenian. Oh, he flicks the elbow. You have something in the tank yourself. You flick the elbow. The win is right there. Come on, guys. Oh, my goodness. This is excruciating. Laporte, get to the front. Come on, come on. This is it. This is it. Vingo. Is Tadabagacha spent two kilometers left here? Oh, Vingo. Have we played a blinder or have we not? Vingo goes for the sprint. Vingo goes for the sprint. Come on. Vingo. 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 Comes out. Jonas, 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 Jonas. Come on. Comes out. Comes out. Comes out. Yeah. Booyah. That's how you do it. Oh. I'm speechless, guys. I was not seeing that coming. 
I thought this would be another one of those videos where I try and win and he finishes 32nd, but probably at the race we would least expect Jonas to win. Well, maybe Paro Bay. We actually are sitting here having done it. And the game didn't even give me an award, so screw the game. But, uh, yeah. Um, maybe this Melissa bike should roll up with uh, Jonas Vingo on Sunday. But, uh, yeah, I'm absolutely speechless. That actually one of the plans worked. Three Danes in top ten. Great to see as well. But, uh, yeah, uh, that, that is basically it for this video. Thanks very much for watching. And... Subscribe to the video if you haven't already. Let's try and get to a thousand. Hit the like button as well because that helps the algorithm gods. And comment down below. I mean, I don't even need your advice here because we won. But uh, yeah, with that, thank you very much for watching. And I will see you in the next one.